Well, as the FIFA saga rumbles on, Jack Warner, the former vice president at the center of allegations about missing millions, has been ordered to hand over his passport to police. As Heather Walker now reports, Warner wants a Trinidadian court to rule on whether he should be extradited to the U.S. to face trial. I left FIFA four years ago. And if FIFA hasn't left me, not my fault. Not my fault. So I'm very early. I am in no way concerned about the FIFA scandal. I'm in no way concerned about the U.S. application for my, for my tradition. That doesn't bother me. Addressing a political meeting, a defiant Jack Warner says he won't give in to pressure from Trinidad's Justice and Legal Affairs Minister to go directly to New York to face trial and save Trinidad's reputation. Mr. Warner wants a local court to rule on whether he should be extradited, hinting at a protracted legal battle. I want my day in court. I want my day in court. And after presenting my side of the argument, I want the courts to decide. This is what we, this country, are used to. The chairman said so a while ago. I don't want any chairman of any integrity commission to try to free me through any back door. I want a judge to say yes or no. Meanwhile, Interpol has suspended a joint anti-match fixing program with FIFA. The International Police Agency is freezing the £14 million donated by FIFA in 2011 for the Integrity in Sport project. And the Paraguayan Congress has approved a measure withdrawing immunity from the Asuncion headquarters of South America's Conmebol Football Federation, some of whose officials were charged with corruption. Conmebol's sprawling headquarters had enjoyed immunity from search since it opened in 1997. Heather Walker, Arise News.